when the Internet of Things is, is really operating, there'll be so many things that just happen automatically. It really will change the environment around us. We have the opportunity to actually harness so much potential. The Internet of Things is the next step in the evolution of the Internet. Whether it's objects in your home, devices that you wear, or factory equipment, the Internet of Things is everywhere. But what exactly is the Internet of Things? IoT is a network of physical devices that are able to exchange data through their embedded internet connectivity. The data from these devices also provides us with insight and control of business operations, making our lives and businesses more efficient. It's everything. It's going to be your clothes, your shoes, your car, your house, the shops. All the products that you take for granted will be able to pass data between them. IoT is, is a fantastic opportunity for us to make the environment smarter, to put sensors into places where we don't really want to put humans, or it may be expensive or dangerous. The industrial IoT, you made great inroads into the use cases that were relevant for manufacturing, for the supply chain, and we're now seeing IoT really coming to the fore. IoT offers great consumer and enterprise opportunity for us to actually get much more precise measurements and information from the world that we live in. We've all experienced this sort of wave of products that are coming that hope to make what we do every day a little bit more seamless. Nearly every product company is making bets on connecting their products. Medication adherence, people not taking their meds, is one of the biggest problems in healthcare. Each year, it adds about $300 billion in cost to the US healthcare system. Our approach is, let's improve that through the tool that the patient uses each and every day, the pill bottle. This is an IoT device, but it's so simple and so seamless that someone that doesn't even own a cell phone can use this. There's a number of sensors that help our system measure whether a patient has taken their dose. If you miss a dose, you get a friendly reminder, like the bottle can pulse. If there are more serious issues like side effects or you need refill support, we can alert you as the patient. True disruption of the healthcare industry will occur when you can put sensors and communication into tools that were previously not connected. Better battery life is really important in this space because a lot of things aren't necessarily connected up with an electrical current. We work on a number of different products and solutions, but one of the exciting ones that we're working on right now is a low power network solution. You're going to be able to go from days to multiple years of battery life. So if you think about something remote, you can now begin to connect things that have never had power to them before. This is an example of what we've done for monitoring shredder bin trash pickups. The company that goes and collects those and shreds the papers had no idea if this had two pieces of paper in it or it was completely full. So we were able to develop a solution that allows them to more predictively send the driver out to exactly those that are full or needed. Another solution we're working on is porta potties. We actually developed a solution that mounts inside. It's monitoring smells and how many people have gone in and used it. So if you think about time, materials, gas cost, by knowing the conditions ahead of time or remotely, there's a tremendous amount of value that can be extracted from that kind of service. Once you've got the connectivity and you now are able to get information, you're now able to do predictive insights based upon the data that we're seeing. We're seeing industries completely transformed across the board. The Internet of Things has raised tremendous security challenges. I think one of our biggest nightmares is yet to happen is around the security risks of IoT devices. So many products were designed with almost no thought to security that there are all kinds of backdoors and issues there. We heard of one company whose uh, hackers got in through an internet connected fish tank. You know, with IoT and the connected home, Somebody could know literally when you're home, what you're doing, what your schedule is by just packing in and monitoring all that data. There needs to be some regulations before they actually get installed in your home. 
The devices and the sensors need to evolve. They need to become things that can be managed in a way like we manage the mobile phone, like we manage the desktop. And I think being able to react quicker um, is going to be critical. I think IoT will definitely create efficiencies and capabilities that we just can't imagine today. The big connectivity advances of building smart cities, smart societies, those are all coming. I think the Internet of Things is going to supplement the Internet. At some point, will my devices be smart enough that I'll forget that the Internet's the connectivity behind it? Maybe. It's going to make you a more rounded human being. It's going to make you more equipped to actually be successful. It will become a mass tool for humanity.